Okay, let's be honest here. When you see this willow called Divine Fog, do you see favor of God on the, how they listed our home over the weekend? Sadly, I think not myself. But finally, from 9 a.m. to around 9 p.m., they finally admitted they listed our home completely and fully wrong. Long day of battling there. But sometimes that's what it takes because I admit I'm Roman 323 myself. I fall short of the glory of God. And I'm as stubborn as the mood they come. And it takes me forever to see the wrong that I do, did. But once I see it, I repent from my heart, not my flesh, and said, yes, I did wrong. And they have done the same thing, even though it took a long time for them to do it. They have admit they listed this home completely wrong. They showed the extreme negative side of this home. We listed it at 175, and the original listing looked like $10,000 home. And that's just the plain truth of what happened. Nothing can, nothing can be done but prayer, and God can turn around and will turn around that extreme negative. We will continue to use this realtor because God had told us to use them. And we are obedient to the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. But we pray, pray, we pray they learn from us on how not to list a home. You never list a home on a negative. You always want to list a home or property on the positive to get that home to sell, not to sell, as happened to us. So we and our realtor are now on the rebound in prayer until Thursday morning to see if online the Company that list these homes where we moved the negative or not we moved the negative from the listing. If they do not, that is not my relative's fault, and I understand that. We must start from scratch and start completely over from ground level. So I'm just praying God will be done with that, that either the negative will be removed. Wonder cycle and be no more or it's simple. We will we start from scratch and we list it from ground level. But again I repeat, me and my husband are very, very forgiving people. We believe in our heart that they simply made a horrible mistake as we all do from time to time. And that they will make it right with us as clients and that they will learn on how to list a home and how not to list a home. And you never list a home in a negative zone. You always try to find that character, that spark of hope in that home. You pray, 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 ask God to give you. Hey man, what's the spark in this home that I'm trying to sell to list? Where is it, Lord? Where is it? Show it to me. And God would show it to them. Amen to that. Because there is hope in this home. This home ran a womb of hope ministry out of this home to give hope to the hopeless that otherwise would have not, never have received hope. And that ministry ran nine plus years. So there's hope right now. So we are in the process of redoing the pictures. Making them a lot more positive than what than they were, and putting light back into the darkness. 
So play, 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 and we turn this negative into a positive. And again, we are not upset at all, we're little. For they are now walking with us. And we are just forgiven by nature and pray that they learn from this adventure. And for not another client have to go through what we've been through. So pray, pray, we pray. I'm praying that you see through this the hand of the load and the power of forgiveness now. Be blessed.